Mustering mustard with mustard. Hello, people. All right, so today we are having mustard like usual, and I don't know why you guys did this, but you decided it was a good idea for me to eat ice cream with mustard. So we're going to be having regular vanilla ice cream, which we have right here, and we got our spoon, and we have a lot of other stuff. Um, we got a lot of new things, in fact, and these things are mustards. Alright guys, and uh, we got a lot, a lot, a lot of new things. Um, however, something very, very sad happened. I had to... I don't even know if I should say the words. I had to throw away a mustard. I know, crazy. It was honey mustard and it was expired. I'm sorry. It's been too long, okay? I didn't take long of a break though, definitely not. Alright, so first... With our uh, ice cream mustard, we are going to have yellow mustard. First one, like usual. We got all of our usuals in here. Dijon mustard, spicy brown mustard, horseradish mustard, which is very spicy. And I literally burned my tongue off. Stone ground mustard, champagne garlic mustard. That's right. Oh, champagne garlic honey mustard. See, I'll fill in for all the mustard. Don't worry. Dusseldorf mustard from Germany. And Gorchitsa. I said that wrong. And Russian mustard, all right? That's right. I don't even know what this is saying. New mustard in the next video? Question mark? Yeah. And here is the ice cream. Better enjoy it while I can because, yes, mustard is great, but also it's not exactly great with ice cream. Take one nice taste, last taste at this. Tastes pretty good. All right, I might cry once, twice, many times in this video. So we have an assistant with us today. All right, here he is, my cat, Snuggy. That's right, say hi to the camera. Ni hao. Very cute, I know. He'll be on the side, standing by, so that, uh, you know, he can help us with all of our mustard needs. Check him out on Instagram. Ah, no! All right, everything is fine and dandy, trust me. And so, first with our mustard, I mean, first with our ice cream, we will be having yellow mustard. This is gonna take so horrible. Oh my God. Here's the ice cream. Ah, cat put a hair in my ice cream. And here we are with the first monstrosity. Mustard on ice cream. I it looks like an egg. Ah It was great guys. No, it was not. Um think I'm gonna have a heart attack after this video, but um you know everything is great guys, trust me. That was not good. This was not good. At first, it kind of blended in. It was nice for a second because, like, it, it just was. I don't know. I'll be uh, talking about them after every single mustard, by the way. And then I'll rate them at the very end. So, yeah. Yellow mustard. I'm guessing that's going to be one of the better ones, unfortunately. So, uh, this is going to be this is gonna be a ride. All right. We got Dijon mustard next. It blends with most things. I really, really doubt that it's going to blend with ice cream. But, hey. It, it's going to happen right now. All right? Ice cream. Here's the Dijon mustard on the ice cream. Actually, the flavors clashed, but it was good at the same time. It was like the vanilla ice cream and the Dijon mustard. And for a moment, it was like, oh my god, why am I doing this? But then after that, it was like, I don't know. So yeah, uh, we are having ice cream with mustard. And it tastes really bad so far. All right. Next up, we have... Spicy brown mustard, that's right. Spicy ice cream. Fun. This is just gonna be absolutely horrible. I simply cannot imagine spicy ice cream.
Luckily, the belt from the ice cream did kind of cool off the mustard, but like at the same time, it's like, no, this is bad. But yeah, that was pretty interesting. You know, I expected it to be a lot more spicy. Maybe I should have put more on. Yeah, let's put more on. Why am I doing this to myself? Oh wait, I didn't put much on here. But... All right, so we have a monstrous heap of spicy brown this time. I don't even need to tilt to show you. <laughs> that was least desirable. Why am I doing this? It was like, okay. And then it was really bad all of a sudden. Next, we got horseradish mustard, of which I cannot handle. This is very spicy, okay? But we're still gonna put a load of it on, because that, that, that makes it more fun for not me. Ugh. I always say mustard is the greatest thing, but right now, it's things aren't going great. I put a lot on, like last time. Okay, that was very interesting. Stone ground mustard. Eat it. All right, loaded it on, just like always. All right, let's eat it. This is gonna be very interesting. And by that, I mean not interesting at all because it's gonna taste disgusting. <clears throat> I'm gonna be traumatized after this video. This is not fun, okay? I hope you know this. All right, here we go. Brand new mustard, guys. Actually tastes really good. Just that, uh, you know, it's kind of, we're kind of having it with ice cream. And that's kind of, you know, uh, maybe not so good. For some reason, ice cream doesn't taste good with mustard. That is so weird. I don't know why, but it isn't. I expected it to be the greatest thing in the entire world. Ha! <laughs> wow, that was very tightly sealed. It looks like applesauce. Interesting. Still tastes pretty good, but it's also like a jar thing, and it's not the squeezable type. So, I have another jar here as well. I, I guess I'll have to get something else to put it on the... Alright guys, so uh, we got knife, 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 yes, chop. Um, we're going to have this champagne garlic honey mustard with vanilla ice cream. Legitimately looks like applesauce. Alright, we're just gonna spread it on like a butternut. Honestly, that looks really tasty because I'm imagining this is caramel, but I know as soon as I bite into this, it's going to be horrible. All right, hope for the best. That was good. I know, call me crazy, like, come on, you're having champagne garlic honey mustard with ice cream and you just said it tastes good i know there's something very very wrong with that and it should not be true at all but it is like i mean i didn't expect this at all but this legitimately tastes good so go ahead and add that to the good counter very epic all right next mustard it's another jar also brand new it, uh, it's, it's the Russian mustard, guys. Russian mustard. Yes, very good. I like this. Um. <laughs> Excuse me. How do we open? Oh, it just tears. Okay. Man, I don't know simple stuff. Shh. It has the little tear thingies off. Let's open it up. Man, brand new lids. Kind of hard to open, not gonna lie. All right, this looks very interesting. I actually want to show you guys what this looks like. This looks very interesting. I honestly really like the way it looks. All right, sorry, I went out of focus there for a second. That definitely never happens. Um, all right, let's try this with ice cream. Hooray, hopefully, hopefully it's good again, you know? Having the last one actually not tasting that bad, I'm a bit more hopeful for mustard now. I, we were in quite a losing streak there, and the phone is thinking that my face is my ear. That's very interesting. That mustard. Very tasty. Focus on the mustard. Mustard. There we go. No, mustard, I said. Mustard. Mustard. Th no! Yes, look at that beautiful mustard. It looks really great, actually. Hi. I'm blurry. Hi. I feel like this one's going to be good. Put this on the ice cream. Uh, this ice cream looks good, but I mean, the, the mustard looks good, but.
That was like a punch. Oh my god. That was a big punch. I didn't expect it to be that flavorful. Very flavorful mustard. I feel like if we weren't having it on ice cream, it would taste very good. But like, I'll have to try it with something normal next time. Like cereal. Wait, that's not normal. And we're on to the last mustard. And from my previous video, what I said was personally my favorite. Dusseldorf. Yeah, very cool. We're gonna have this with our ice cream. It's gonna be the last one, guys. Very epic. Get ready, guys. Oh my god, I put so much more than I thought I was going to. Look at this. Oh my god, there's like as much mustard as there is ice cream. That was by far the worst one. Oh my god. <laughs> so, that was uh, least to say not very tasty. Now let's go ahead and rate all of them. Yellow mustard out of 10. This was one of the better ones, like I expected. Uh, you know, I think I'll give this one 7 out of 10. It, it was, it wasn't bad. It, it kind of went with it, but I don't know, That that was... That was bad, right? That was bad. It had to be bad. Dijon mustard. It blended a little bit, but it also kind of didn't. I'll give it a 6 out of 10. Not very epic. Spicy brown mustard, guys. That was that was pretty darn bad. The spicy ones were bad. Okay, it was bad. Uh, I'll give this a 4 or 3 out of 10. I don't know. 4. 4. We'll go 4. We'll try and be nice to mustard, okay? Mustard is still our friend. You have to remember that. Horseradish mustard. I kind of figured this would be pretty darn bad. It wasn't as spicy as I expected. I guess that makes sense though, because you know, the ice cream has milk in it, and milk is what you're supposed to drink when you eat something spicy, so it kind of cut that off. But I still got to have the flavor of the mustard. And so the flavor wasn't too bad, if I'm remembering right, but yeah, I'll, I'll give it a six out of 10. It's, it wasn't bad. Stone ground, that was pretty bad. It kind of had that kind of taste, it was almost trying to be spicy. The flavor got into my nose and it was like, just no, it was not a good time. Okay. It was not epic. All right. The, uh, champagne garlic honey mustard. Like I told you that really wasn't bad. Like that tasted genuinely good. Like I, if I had to eat it again, I would, but things like Dusseldorf, that was just no opposite of the spectrum. This was good. I will give this a 9 out of 10. If you ever, for some horrible reason, decide that you want mustard on your ice cream, get champagne, garlic, honey mustard. I actually expected this to be one of the worst ones. Kind of had, it had the honey mustard feel to it, and then it had a sweetness added on the end as well. And that kind of combined with the ice cream, and I think it was actually really interesting flavor and sensation. Again, I really did enjoy that one. Russian mustard. You know, I, I think I put a bit too much of that on. Um, that was that was not too enjoyable. Again, I really feel like it would be more tasty on other things along with all of these mustards. It would be so much better on something different. I don't know why I would ever do this to myself. This was horrible. We're just gonna... Yeah. <laughs> we'll give it a 5 out of 10. It was solid. Maybe 6. 6 out of 10. It was solid, alright? It was, it was not bad. Dusseldorf mustard. Literally, this was one of the worst tastes I've had in my life. Like, it wasn't that kind of, like, wretched taste, but it was bad, dude. It was, like, expired eggs blended up with chicken legs. Oh my god, that rock. It, it would not suggest at all. Never, ever. Like, do not do this. Ever. Please, for the love of God, do not have to use dwarf mustard with ice cream. No, don't do it. But, uh, yeah, that almost concludes our mustard video. But there is one thing left, guys. One thing left. Mustard fact of the day. I... We still have to eat some ice cream. You know, I kind of want to like enjoy ice cream today and not just absolutely murder my taste buds with something horrible. <sighs> it's still in my mouth. All right, well, I hope you liked this permanently traumatizing video. 
of mustard. We'll be back with another video soon. Needle in a haystack. Be very fun. Alright? And I'll see you guys in the next video.